What is up guys? Biggie the Barber and this is still shaky as hell, but it is just okay because this is the intro to a beautiful day. We're driving the trailer. We're going to Middlesburg. We're going to pick up some Bob and Chance. You're going to come with us for the ride. Stay tuned. Anyway, we're at the house and now we're gonna like try to film and see if this guy's into filming and getting cameras shoved in his face because I don't think he's really into that, you know what I mean? Because we're out here in the boondocks. I think we're here. We're here and I'm here. Does that mean we're here? We're here? I'm here and you're here. Doesn't that make it our time? We're here. We're, we're I mean, we're in this place. We're gonna get shot. Call the guy. Ready? Dude, call the guy. I need to shake my I'm gonna send up. some Morse code. Hey, can I send some Morse code? Surprised we haven't gotten like shot. You said the second driveway on the left? Oh shit, he's over there. <laughs> He, he's giving us the barber chair and the chairs, the waiting room chairs, the brains and the shit. What, the, what am I eating in the brains? What does that mean? We'll I'm be swinging I'm, around town. I'm totally okay with being smart. Oh. If I need to do something, yeah, don't get in my way. I'm trying to see. And know things. I'm not in your way. Your mirror is up there. Okay, but you're low key in my way. There's a dog. Don't I tell the dog. I'm not gonna run over the. Watch dog. the dog. Thank God my daddy told me how to back Pour in the trailer. Who the dog? Like he owned a barber shop. Yeah, and then he got all his Corona shit, and then he got all excited and. Closed it up. Wow. That was sitting outside the door. Everyone, they inside the school. They said outside. Yeah, that's cool. Let's be like trailers making love. Is that what that is right there? <laughs> <laughs> be on the barbershop. Forty-five years. You should have told him to come down. If, yeah, well, it broke his heart. Believe it or not. Oh no, really? Yeah. Well, they're in good hands. All right, guys. I'm here with Brad. Uh, we're over here in Middleburg. 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 We're getting an old school barber chair from his grandfather Barry. Uh, during this whole pandemic thing, Barry was really upset, had to close down shop, and you know, he's kind of calling it quits, like a lot of people in this industry. And so we have the privilege of being able to take this chair and put it in one of our shops and you know, to send a video later on to Barry of other people getting their haircuts in and this chair is kind of like leading his legacy on. So I think this is so cool. Brad, I appreciate your no time. Problem. I appreciate, I appreciate you giving us some cool stuff here. Yep. There's the cash there. And um, yeah, guys, on to the next one. <laughs> Let go of my wheel. I got it. I got it. That we drive around and do different events, cut people's hair and everything on the bus. We have a generator for it. So you were a barber of your own shop? For over 30 years. Wow. I sold my building. Barber, you gotta pay your own. I still cut until about 10, 11 years ago. I mean, I still did a couple of haircuts here. But... On a on a shaving shear, okay? You want a, a, a 90 degree corner, okay? There's the one you really like. There. That's the one I like a lot, yeah. Do these two for 20? Uh, the, the shears and the, the blade? Yeah. Cool, I'll do 20. I do like these, these this is cool. That one ain't going home. I know, that's cool, you know? Look at that, That's a man. double duck. All right, guys, so we're picking up our the next and last chair for this trip, and Matt here is hooking us up. With it, it's from the 1940s, guys. Wow. Guys, you know Nicky P, he's got all these old school chairs. This is like a classic. Our man right here got his barbering license back in 1979. Nine. 1979. And so all that hair. cool equipment. You even get some hair with it. There you go. That's vintage. That's there extra. I think I do have one more thing. And one more thing. Yeah, Stay one more tuned. Thing. That's what we want to hear. One more thing. <laughs> <laughs> is that the kid's seat? Yes, it is. No way. No way. No way. No way. That's cool. Look at that thing. You adjust it. Talk about not being super comfortable, man. That's why little kids hate to get in their haircut. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> old school history. It's like the old fashioned cars, guys. When you come to Modern Mail, you get class, style, you get vintage, all in a modernized shop. All right, guys, I'm pretty sure we're in the classiest place. Eric and I had to figure we'd pull over for this beauty right here. Be sure some people died there. I want to go home. Oh yeah. Don't tell my sister I'm cheating on my diet. Pa, look at the pretty views. Would you look at that? We should vacation here. We bring the kids back. We should. Love Ciao. It. They would love it. Bye. Bye, Paul. Bye, everybody. And that is a wrap. Drop Paul off. 
I got a couple more chairs to drop off, but I'm gonna go do that real quick. Like, thank you for coming and enjoying our day in the life. A little sneak peek. We'll come back with another video. See y'all later. Oh yeah, stay safe out there with all this bullshit going on.